Join me as I try to master the art of concealer lips for the perfect pout. Let's see if I can pull it off. Did you know that using concealer on your lips can give you a beautiful pout and make your lipsticks last longer? Welcome to today's video guys where I am going to be trying concealer lips now. It's not like I've never done this before. And I have actually three products on my desk at the moment. I've got the NYX Bear With Me Concealer Serum. I have the e.l.f. Uh, this one is the, the 16 hour camo concealer. And I also thought I'd pull out this Tarte Shape Tape Wand. Now this is actually a concealer as well product that you can use. So we'll see how it goes now. Also, I decided I'd pull out all my lip liners. Now these are just like $1 lip liners from AOA Beauty. We're not going to be using this pink shade here, so I'll just put that away. But I thought to use the browner tones, the ones that are more like skin tone color. Make sure your lips are hydrated. Make sure they have been exfoliated. Make sure that they're smooth and they're not dry. Now on my lips at the moment, I have just actually blotted my lips and taken off the lip gloss that I had on. I'll show you which one I was using. I couldn't find my Sonzi one because I think I just filmed a video and it's somewhere in the depth of the makeup box that I had. Anyway, um, so I just used this one here. This is the Aesop Cedar and Citrus Lip Salve. I'll show you what I did exactly. So I pretty much just whacked that on. And I had this on pretty much for about half an hour. Let it sit, let it sink in. I would definitely do this after exfoliating your lips. If you don't have an issue with dry cracked lips, you can skip that step. But now I'm gonna go ahead and wipe this off because it's crucial to not have glossy or any kind of balm on your lips before we apply the concealer. Mm, this does have a lovely taste to it. This really is yummy. All right, which concealer am I gonna use? You know what, I am gonna go ahead and use the, the e.l.f. Camo Concealer. Line the lips first, that is what I'm gonna be doing. But I don't know which shade I'm gonna be using. Let's just test out on the back of my hand which ones that I like. There's this one, I'm gonna make sure that I when I put it down. This one here is um, called Lasso. Let's see what this next one is. Pony. So that was Lasso. This is Pony. Oh no, that's that's actually pink. We don't want to use... We're not using this one, so scrap that one out. Okay, the next one is called Rodeo. Rodeo. I mean, I do have other lip liners, but I just wanted to pull out my AOA Beauty ones. And that one there, that's a little bit warm toned. That one here is called Whiskey. So I'm thinking for concealer lips, I wanna do this one here, which is the Rodeo. I am gonna overdraw the lips. And really take your time to not rush this step because when you do the outline of your lips you really just want to you're creating the shape essentially now you don't have to overdraw but i like to overdraw the lips to obviously make them look fuller i'm not going to be filling in my lips with this color i'm just outlining all right Time for concealer. Going in with the the e.l.f. 16 hour matte finish concealer. Now, I don't know how much I need to put. Start off with a little and then blend it out. Okay, that's the bottom lip. Now apply on the top. Okay, 
I'm doing the padding motion. Okay, now just making sure it's even. Okay, so now that we've got the concealer laid down, it's time to go in with a gloss. Now you can leave it matte, but I think it's gonna look better with a bit of shine. So I'm going back in with my lip salve and I'm putting a little bit of that on my finger. I'm making sure to blend it with the lip liner. And there we have it guys. Now, I really don't know if I like this look at all. Hmm, what do you guys think? I'm not a fan, honestly. I really am not a fan of it at all. Now, if I wanted to make this look better, how would I fix it? Well, firstly, I would take the lip balm off just by blotting it gently. Geez, now I've got sunscreen lips. All right, I'm gonna go in with a warmer toned lip liner. This one's in Whiskey. And I'm just going to outline the lips again. Just blending. Now I'm gonna apply a touch more concealer to the bottom lip. I'm blending in the lip liner. Okay, that's I think as good as it's gonna get. I will apply a little bit more gloss on the center of the lip. And there guys, that's I think as good as it's gonna get. I think for future concealer lips, maybe just stick with a nude lipstick and then call it concealer lips because <laughs> using concealer on your lips it's just got the it's the opacity of the formula you know it's uh it's a concealer i mean yeah go ahead and put it on your lips if you want to actually put a different color lipstick on top because it'll probably make it last longer but But yeah, I'm I'm just not really a fan. So so yeah, guys, have you tried? Do you guys do this every day on a daily basis? Um, do you feel like you possibly could look like a corpse with these type of lips? Because I'm telling you what, it's not flattering. I mean, look butthole lips guys thank you so much for watching i will see you all again in my next video love you and leave you bye for now